giant spider caught a cicada. What's up guys? Today we're at location C and uh, it's the calm before the storm. It's about to rain like later this afternoon and also tomorrow so let's see how it goes. Try right by that by that tree right there. Oh shoot! I hooked a plant behind me. Well, that sucks. I just fished a spot where uh, I caught a lot of bass last time when it was a uh, pretty sunny and there were no bites. There were no nibbles. I saw like maybe one or two pretty big bluegill there, but they didn't seem very interested. So I came to this other corner here. I was over there, now I'm over here. There's a lot of uh, gunk on the side and uh, branches, but maybe the fish will be here. Let's see how this goes. First cast. a lot of uh, bluegills spawning on the left side here. That left corner, so let me try casting over. I might have to fast retrieve just because there's so much stuff on the bottom. The fish might not even see it. Oh, finally nibbled. Okay. Okay. Got him. Small guy. Oh, it's a crappie. Ew. <laughs> this is this is the only place where I get a crappie. Check it out. There we have it. Like a seven inch. Oh my god, look at the tail fin. It's got bitten off. This poor guy. Also seems like uh, it's got hooked before, so let him go. That was like a maybe eight inch, nine inch crappie. Kind of messed up one. Here we go again. I really don't like uh, crappie that much because they're super slimy. And if I have to grab onto them. Just can't get that slime off your hand. Uh, that's why uh, I bring a towel now, just in case I get coffee or any slime on my hand, I can just wipe it off. I think we're done here. I think it's just that one coffee that lives here. I'm gonna switch to the lake on the other side of the road. I was about to go down there from here. Good thing I checked with my fishing rod, did the fishing rod test, because there was a giant spider web here. The spider just uh, came out of nowhere. This is another place where I fish all the time. Uh, but the problem with this place is there's so many mosquitoes and uh, they really get on you quick. Even when if I have bug spray they'll still get on me so I gotta just move around I guess and uh Try to avoid these mosquitoes. All right, here we go. Out goes the bait. Close the bale. Let it sink to where the fish are. Slow retrieve. Not that slow, actually, but what was that? The grass. Yep. Uh, what's it 
called Hydrilla. Oh my god. It's just a lot of uh, grass in there. It's confusing me. It's making me think there's a fish. See those rocks over there? I only fished on those rocks like once or twice. I think I've seen blow ups over there, so I'm gonna try fishing over there. You just gotta find your own path. Because there's no clear path. Oh my god. Oh god, I almost died there. <laughs> Whew. Something really stinks here. Uh, hope it's not my fishing skills. It's a ninja course. Uh, we're almost to the middle. Good thing the, oh my god, that looks like a snake. It's just a piece of rope. But, um, yeah, good thing it's not very hot today. That means there's not many bugs hanging around over here. Usually there's a bunch of gnats and different wasps, uh, different pollinators over here. But today it's just a couple flies. Bunch of garbage, beer bottle, plastic bags, oh, styrofoam, uh, carry out a container, I think. Other than that, nothing's gonna sting me. So that's good, okay. I'm gonna try casting right in the middle here. I mean, I think this, oh my god, this yellow perch almost uh, followed, followed up out of the water. But this lake is supposed to be, um, I think like a trophy bass lake. I don't know what that means. So yeah, this is not as good of a spot as I thought it would be. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. There's not many uh, good spots around here. And I think, oh my god, there's a bass following it. Oh my god, I think that was the bass that was following it. And it just turned away. See that? See the waves there? What is that? Now it's gone. I have a lot of questions. And I need answers. Questions like, why am I not getting a bite? It was a struggle getting on those rocks. And I didn't get any bites. Hard work doesn't always pay off, you also need luck. And in my case, I need lots of luck. The thing with here is that uh, there's tons of grass right here, but if I get past this like 15, 20 foot range, then uh, it gets deeper, I believe. So I can try to, oh my God, there's, oh, I already messed up my bait. Let's try this again. Oh, that was pretty bad. Keep it in there. Oh, that's a fish. That's a fish. <laughs> the line moved. Oh, you're not going anywhere. I'm landing you. There we go. Oh my God, tiny guy. Okay. Okay. Oh my God, what happened? Yo, this fish is messed up. Oh my God, okay, let me. Let, let me get it off first. Guys, this fish is like messed up. Let me show you why. Gonna turn him around? Or her? Look at that. That's nasty. What? It, it's like pus coming out of it. I don't know what what that is. That's nasty. It's bleeding. I'm, I'm just gonna toss it in. That is absolutely nasty. Gonna wash my hand off. Just because, uh, hey, hey, look, it's a snail. Oh, that would have been a blow up. Let me investigate right there. I cast right where I saw the blow. Not really right where it is, but close enough. That's as close as I can. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no, no, oh my god, no way. Oh my god, that guy broke me off. That was a monster. Oh no. That fish, I'm pretty sure it was a fish, broke me off and I 
thought I had a fish and then I tried to set it a second time because I really didn't set the hook and the second time I pulled on it and it just broke off. Since I'm really not having any luck here, I really don't want to do this but I'm going to walk some distance. It's not very far but I wasn't planning on walking that far from uh, the car. I'm going to walk some distance and go to this uh, one fishing spot. It's a little cove. and see if I can uh, maybe get some yellow perch. Let's get some yellow perch. Or, or bass, even better. Or a monster, but I think that was my chance today to get a monster. It could have been a monster, could have been a snag. I'm going to call it a snag because I don't want to feel bad about myself not catching that. If I can't catch anything there, I'm just going to call it a day. Look at this grasshopper. It, bl it's, it blends in so well with the vegetation. With the green and the, some spots of brown, just like these plants. Really cool looking. Where'd it go? See, this is what I mean. Where'd it go? Oh, it's right here. See? Alright guys, this is the spot. It's a, it's a cove. 